we have to find general term for the given sequence. We have first term, I can write a1 is 2 over 4, the second term is 4 over 5, the third term is 8 over 6, and the fourth term is 16 over 7, and so on. So what we have here, we have fractions. We need to find the pattern. In these fractions, our numerator is 2, 4, 8, 16, and so on. So we see that we have here power of 2. 2, 4, so it will be 2 to second power, 2 to third power is 8, 2 to fourth power is 16. So our general term we can rewrite a n is equal in our numerator we have for sure 2 to n power when n is equal 1 will be 2 when n is equal 2 will be 4 for n equals 3 will be 8 for n equals 4 will be 16 and so on and what with our denominator we have 4 5 6 7 we have here sequence we know that the sequence we need used to describe a function whose domain consists of positive integers. So 1, 2, 3, 4 and so on. In our example we see that our denominator is 4, 5, 6, 7. We start from 4. So if I write n it will be wrong because we cannot, when we substitute n by 1, we will have in the numerator 1. We need to have 4. So to get 4, I will write first that we have 3 plus n. When n is equal 1, so we will have 3 plus 1 will be 4. When n is equal 2, we will have 3 plus 2 is 5. For n equals 3, we will have 3 plus 3 is 6. For n equals 4, will be 3 plus 4 is 7. So we got our pattern. In our numerator, we have power of 2. And in denominator, we have to have constant 3. And we add n, when n is any positive integer. So we can rewrite that a n general term is 2 to power n and we first write n plus constant 3. So this is my solution.